So when we come down to court, when we come down to court, foul line extended you, uh, most times we're like just like this. Two guards, two forwards, and a center. Now, just like that, we can be in our one, two, two spots. All right. But the foundation here is that it's hard to guard a guy here and also there. Right? The basket, that's where we score. All right. So if we start here rather than, you know, just right in this area, then you're making the team decide how they're going to guard you. Now, nobody making this shot, I realize that. But the space and the movement is going to help us to get them moving and reacting to us more quickly. Okay. So what I want to show you first here is just gold. Okay. And gold is basically straight to one, two, two. Now, there's two ways that you can, you can start it. Lance can throw it to Jordan and same corner cut and Casey will same corner cut. Uh, Shane is going to come high and we're, we're basically in five out around the perimeter. One, two, two. Okay. I believe that the better way to, to get it started because of movement, especially at our level, is to cross the court to get one, two, two start, gold started. So we would send them through to gold, in which case Casey would cut through and to the opposite corner. Lance would dribble off and hit and same corner cut. Shane would come high. And now we're in our one, two, two spots. Okay? The, the wings, the forwards, which began wide. For example, if we called gold and we're starting on that side, you know, like he's going toward um, Jake, on that pass, Jordan's walking in right to the three point line. And then on the pass back to the top, he's walking in. Now we're right kind of where we need to be. Okay? Now the foundation of one, two, two is now the center is going to make a decision. For the beginning, he's just going to dribble at either side he chooses. Okay? Let's say he went to Jordan's side. It's good to go opposite just because it's you know, reversing the court, although there's occasions where it's great to go right back at the guy. If you want to get a quick shot and late in the possession, going right back at where you got it. A lot of times if it were a shooter, you might get that guy on his heels and you might be able to get a quick shot stopping behind. Now, go ahead, go back, I'm sorry. One, two, two, okay, he dribbles at him. The first thing we'd tell this guy to do is just go back door. And that would be because, coach, you want to jump in there and just, that would be because he's guarding him, you know, kind of hard and not making it easy for him to just come get the ball clean. So go ahead, he goes back door and throws it to him. All right. 